welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie. I'm the author of four, soon to be five, contemporary novels. But today's video is another one of my get to know author videos based on prompts from the Everyman Author Platform Bundle by Marissa Mohi. If you're interested to see what those prompts are and what the bundle is, go ahead and check out the description in the box below. I have all that there, as well as my books and everywhere else you can find me online. But let's get cracking on this prompt. And this one is about how I draft and edit my novel. I have some notes here so I can get this nice and concise if possible. All right, so today's video is going to be about how I draft and edit my drafts. Everyone does this differently and what works for me may not work for you. So I just want to preface by saying this is what I do and this is how I do things. So um, once I have my note cards that have one to two sentences per scene i write the scene and at this point i don't really worry about where the chapters are or what scenes belong in each chapter i just write the scenes and then i worry about the chapters later and my chapter is usually about two to four thousand words so once i get around like three thousand words i check to see how many more scenes would make sense for the end of the chapter or if the scene is the end of the day then i end the chapter there as well all right, so I write out the scenes and I usually have a good flow until about 25 to 30,000 words. At that point, I set aside I set aside the draft and then I brainstorm on paper what could happen from the muddy middle to the end. Not the very end because I always have a good idea of how my novel is going to end. And then, so once I have those chapters drafted, then I move the file from Scribner's, which is where I draft it, into a pre-formatted um document that has all the chapter and margins and everything set up the way i like and i've done this like the for lack of last last i've done this for the last four novels so i know this is what works next next comes a fun editing part so first i go through and correct all the typos because there's always a lot of typos because i type faster than i think and then um i go and change the fonts and i give it a read through one chapter at a time then um, once I read through one chapter at a time and see that I've corrected all the typos and any like spelling mistakes and changing characters names throughout the book, then I give it to a couple different readers. I have a reader that goes through and checks it for any like, I would say they're a line editor, checks for any um, spelling errors, punctuation marks, and someone else goes and reads through it and makes sure there's no plot holes that I have missed. Okay, so once this has been done, then I read through it one more time after I apply, I'll go through and make sure that their corrections and suggestions make sense. Then I read through it one more time before ordering a proof copy of my novel, just to make sure I verify it and make sure everything looks good. The only difference with this process, with this current novel that's releasing in a couple of weeks, is that, um, in two weeks actually, is that I was not able to wear a proof copy because I do not have a place I can receive a book in a timely fashion at this time. Well, that is the rundown of how I draft and edit my novels. It doesn't really change from novel to novel. It might change how long it goes or how long it takes to edit, but that's my process. All right, I think that's it for me today. Thanks again for watching this video all the way through. If you liked this video, go ahead and hit the like button down below. If you want to hear more of my videos, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. In the meantime, have a wonderful day.